Hi, I'm John Twist of University Motors. Today I want to talk a little bit about MGA frames. I've got an MGA frame here in front of me. This is a pretty nice frame for Michigan showing all the rust that might occur next to the floorboard and we've ordered up a number of uh, repair panels and so forth. Uh, you can get your repair panels from Moss Motors. You can also buy repair panels from sports, sports car craftsmen in Arvada, Colorado. Um, anyway, it's usually this whole section that's necessary. Moss sells all the little tiny corner pieces that fit in very, very nicely. I'm not sure that this is the, uh, there, there we go. This is nice heavy metal and it needs to be welded in. The old metal needs to be cut away. We had to uh, cease grinding here uh, or else we would have all gone mad. So we're, we're getting a plasma cutter. We're going to go ahead and, and cut the metal out of the way. But as you can see down here, this metal has been cut away here and uh, there are repair panels that, that we have to go. The um, floorboard pieces are very nice. They, they fit into place. They've got the, the threaded fasteners in place. Um, another trick here is to make sure that you've got the floorboards so you can put the floorboards in place and bring the, uh, these panels, the floorboard panels up against the bottom of the floor. You can also use a trick of drilling these and drilling them through and holding them in place temporarily with a, uh, uh, a screw, something like that, so that you, you don't end up with them on an, on an angle. Um, here we've got uh, blueprint, blueprints for the floorboards, um, but it's, it's better to have the, the floorboards themselves to get that level uh, fit that's necessary. Obviously the cardboard can, can, uh, can bend. It's not uncommon for the battery boxes to fail. You can see down, down here that this battery box is completely toast, to use the favorite breakfast term, uh, showing how badly this stuff can get wrecked. And this one's pretty beat up also. Since most people now elect to go to a single 12 volt battery, uh, it's not necessary to have both battery bins in place. And if you are going to repair one, repair the one on the right side, the passenger side of the frame, and extend it just a little bit so that you can fit a group 26 battery. As it is right now, um, the, uh, the whole size is about seven, just a little bit bigger than seven by seven inches. And if you put a modern battery in, it's going gonna, it's gonna to teeter on this edge. That's not good. We end up having to take a piece of uh, plywood and cut it seven and a quarter by seven and a quarter, stack it up high enough so the battery sits on top of this whole thing. But if you're going to extend, like here, extend it, you can, you can put, bring some angle iron out and back and make it just large enough for your, your Group 24. So this, uh, this frame has been sandblasted. Then we used OSFO on it, uh, which is a, a non-oxygen rusting agent that uses phosphate and protects the metal against rust for a while until we can go ahead and paint it or have it powder coated. Hey, I want to tell everybody we're going to be in Chicago this weekend, the, uh, whatever this weekend is, about the 25th or so of February at the DuPage County Fairgrounds uh, as part of the Chicago Land. MG Club swap meet there. It's a, it, it's a really, really nice event. There's a lot of people there, a lot of stuff, all the way from greasy, mangly pieces of stuff. And you go, why would someone bring that? To really nice stuff, new stuff, used stuff, accessories, all kinds of stuff. We'll be there uh, selling some DVDs and our tech books. And I want to remind everybody that our technical s seminar the first one we've had in a couple of years here on site is coming up the weekend after next, which is the first weekend in March. There's still room there, so call us, contact us if you'd like to come along. Our gearbox seminar is full. 
but we still have room at that seminar. After that, I'll be at Quality Coaches in Minneapolis around, I want to say around the 16th, I don't have it right in front of me, of uh, March uh, at Mark Brandau's Quality Coaches in Minneapolis. Uh, so we're looking forward to a real thoroughly octagonal springtime, a lot of action, a lot of cars. Oh my gosh, the weather outside today is just phenomenal. So stay tuned to our website. Thank you very much. We'll see everybody soon.